Matt Walsh is making uh, a new movie for people who don't necessarily want to kill themselves to kind of finally get over that last hurdle and permanently check out of the misery that is this life. So if you're if you've been on the fence, right? If you've been thinking about kevorkying yourself, Matt Walsh is creating a new movie for you because it is going to be unfathomably unfunny, low effort, low testosterone, low T content. Um, from a guy whose entire voice sounds like it was put together by him jamming a fucking bad dragon dildo down to this fucking hilt down his throat. I, I really can't describe how horrible I, how much I hate Matt Walsh's voice. Um, but he has been trying to satch a Baron Cohen people too, uh, very much like J-Reg, but with way less success and way less funny. And he's been sharing the clips on his Twitter, I've heard. And I want to share some of them. It's for his new movie, Matt Walsh, Am I Racist? Spoiler, yes, Matt Walsh is racist. Matt, Matt Walsh has always been a racist. Matt, Matt Walsh is a racist and a misogynist and a, a homophobe and, and, and every other fun word that for some reason, I don't know I don't know why they get upset about it. I, like I feel like if I just did racist shit all the time and I stood for racism, I would just go for it. That's why I have a lot more respect for, I guess, like Nick Fuentes over Matt Walsh if I had to pick between the two, because at least Fuentes is like very obviously like a closeted homosexual racist troll and and, and and he just owns it. Matt Walsh, I believe, is also a closeted homosexual racist troll, but he like went so far with so far with the beard thing that he grew a beard and now plays dress up on TV for some fucking reason and, and, and his ass mad on the behalf of all other racist Republicans that he gets called racist. I've never said the, uh, I've never said, uh, I've never said, um, hold on. I can almost, I can almost get it. I've never said, uh, anything racist, um, uh, in my life. <laughs> I can't fucking do it. We didn't watch some of this dude's fucking dog shit ass videos. In this scene from my upcoming film, am I racist? I was honored to earn a seat at the table during a race to dinner session. I was even more honored to lead the women in a toast to racists. Tickets on sale at amiracist.com. Because we're not, we're not, we're, we're not in, we're not in fucking movie phone, unfortunately. Uh, for many decades, and it was a miserable experience. Uh, and really, the 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 hatred of yourselves. Like, are you gonna go to this movie and just sit there feeling insanely fucking awkward for an hour? Uh, he's such a weird looking guy. It's just other Vosh. Fake, fake, fucking looking beard. I, uh, there's something just deeply unsettling about Matt Walsh. appreciate. Like, I think it really is. So he's got like pockmarked up skin is his whole issue, which is why he fucking wears a beard. It's not because he likes it particularly. But the beard looks fakey for some reason. Like, it looks like an overused broom where all the fucking like the plastic ends are all fucking like matted together. No, if you guys ever use brooms to like uh, clean hot stuff, and the broom melts on the end. That's what Matt Walsh's fucking beard looks like. And it just has a fakeness to it. It's like Steve Harvey's mustache. You know, where you're like, there's something fucking wrong with it. Everything about the guy is just so fake and put on to do like the most cringe racism shit. I don't understand his entire deal. I thought there were some more of these. Where's 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 the rest of it? Oh god, end wokeness. I'm playing I'm I'm really playing fucking Russian roulette scrolling through his shit. What in the fuck? It's this thing again, 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 again. Most of the fucking videos of him are him getting like caught and people saying, like, are you an actor or you're like real weird? He was at the DNC too. Well, why the fuck I got all this going on here? He was at the DNC too, um, undercover. I don't know if you guys noticed that. Matt Walsh went undercover to an anti-racist support group for his new documentary. They kicked him out and called the police because his presence made them feel unsafe. <laughs> Am I racist? Hits theaters September 13th. Like, he's just super fucking weird. Like, he didn't have the lie ready. It's crazy. It's such lazy content. Like, <laughs> how do you not have your alias? 
your alias. How do you not have your alias like on hand, right? I would just say I'm Matt Walsh, notable internet racist. <laughs> like, just say it. You know what I mean? Like, shouldn't you be confronted? Like, what are you revealing about these people by your presence in the the skit? Shouldn't you just like if you just film them without you there? Aren't they gonna say the same shit? Like you got no fucking sense of of the scene. He's not funny at all. He's just weird. He's just doing weird shit. It's a weird fucking guy, Matt Walsh. Right? Just everything about him is deeply suspicious. What are you gonna do today, Matt? I'm gonna put on bad costumes. And, <laughs> that's a different fucking person I'm making fun of. Also a live streamer. <laughs> I'm gonna put on uh, costumes and I'm gonna go uh, invade a. Uh, I'm going to invade a uh, support group for racists, and I'm going to see if they're racist as well. Like, okay, we, we, you could do any. Don't you have a kid? <laughs> what if you took your kid to the park or something instead? Like, you could do that. Like, uh, America's falling apart, and uh, what I need to do is I need to go infiltrate anti-racist spaces to prove that the anti-racists are the true racists. Like, uh, what? What I need to do is some subterfuge, and uh, I need to do subterfuge. Uh, I have a, a few costumes I've been thinking of. I, I just really want to put on some wigs. I have a specific type of wig. I, I want to wear white, straight hair, uh, blonde hair. I would like to wear blonde hair and a ponytail. I've always thought of myself like what I would look like with blonde hair and a ponytail on. Uh, but with my beard... My beard, which is somehow one of the weirdest looking beards in the history of mankind. Nobody knows how it got so weird looking. It looks like it's strapped on, maybe glued on. And my glasses, uh, and my 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 dis completely expressionless weird fucking face. I'm gonna sit there and I'm gonna try to convince people that I'm a different human than the human I am. Okay, can you even convince people that you're human? I have trouble with that. Uh, the left likes to say that I'm 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 a freak and I'm strange and I'm weird. That my baby toy that I made of myself is a strange thing to do. I don't think it's strange at all. I think that the strange thing is DEI. I think it's strange that people do gay sex uh, on the internet. I think that um, the purchase and sale of dolphin fins is uh, something that needs to be deregulated. Uh, I don't understand why uh, people don't uh, beat women in the street like they used to in movies I saw from 1922. I don't understand why children are allowed to breathe if they are uh, non-white. I, I don't understand. And these are weird things. Like, <laughs> his head, his brain sounds like, like when you hear him talk, it's like the static that you hear in your fucking head if you robo-trip. Like if you actually fucking make yourself mildly brain damaged by overdosing on cough medicine, you hear the same like rhythm and tone as fucking... <laughs> you need to shave your beard. You gotta, you gotta shave your beard or just unglue it. <laughs> One of the two, like you gotta fucking take that, you gotta take that fucking skinned dead rat off your fucking face if you want to fit in because you look like the notable multi-million follow constantly reshared by all of the most notable Twitter racists guy, Matt Walsh. You look like known internet racist, Matt Walsh, notable uh, notable theocratic fascist psycho weird fucking guy Matt Walsh. You look like you look like the person who only you could look like. You you. It's weird that you're so fucking freaky built, and you sound so weird. Uh, do, what do you What do you mean? I do. do I need a. Do I need a a better disguise? Uh, like, I, can can you guys workshop with me? I, I'm trying to embarrass you. By making you seem like the racist, uh, you're all probably catching on to the idea that I set this up. I set up this support group. There are cameras everywhere. Uh, I, did, I put cameras everywhere around you to film you without your knowledge, uh, to try to catch you being racist while you came to do a racism survival support group. You might think that's weird. Uh, I think it's weird that uh, children can get married only once they're adults. I think it's very strange. I think it's weird that people don't go 
uh, back in time just by thinking of it so that they can uh, have a slave cast that works for them and, 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 and picks vegetables and stuff for their all-white family on, on their ranch. I think it's weird that you can't do that. I think it's weird that... Uh, uh, you know, it's strange that the Revolutionary War is thought of, the Confederacy is thought of in such negative terms in, in America. I think that's weird. I, can you, can you, can, can somebody explain to me why that's uh, weird? Why that's strange? Uh, I don't think you can. I think because you're, you're, you're cucked liberals. I don't know why you want me to leave. I don't understand why you want me to uh, get out of here. I don't understand why, you, why do you want me, why do you think I'm strange? Why do you think, uh, people keep calling me a cuck soy boy liberal. I mean, I know I'm built like uh, one of those signs that people wave out in front of a tax center or whatever um, in tax season. People look, I, I look like somebody could stick a doorknob to the back of me and spin me around to announce a sale of some sort. But uh, you understand that I, I'm one of the last bastions of masculinity. Me and my glued on uh, beard that covers my weirdly jutting lower face that sticks out of my head like a melted Barbie doll, Ken doll, whatever. And it's weird that you would make the connection uh, between me and a sexless, genderless, uh, plastic freak toy. I'm not like that. I have a functioning penis. It's always worked. It's worked very well. I don't have any issues with it. And it's weird that you would take it in that direction. It's strange... Uh, strange that people would call me a sexless, you know, only a mound down there, Ken doll made out of leftover parts from a toy bin, cursed with magic by a Confederate wizard. Uh, that's strange to me that you would even make that connection. It's it's weird, weird that you guys are doing that to me. I'm perfectly normal. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. Thank you so much. I really had. He cruises beer like he cruises viewers. Myself. And my pronouns are he, him. <laughs> Check his heels for peg holes. He's a wax sculpture made fres flesh. I did everything I could to fit in. I opened up. I was raw and emotional. I told them about my black friends. It was no use. They rejected me. And they called the police. My mere presence in the room caused them pain. I'll never be accepted if I look like this. If they know that I'm Matt Walsh, I'll always be an outsider. I need to go deeper undercover, a whole new identity. If I want to be an ally, I need to look like one. Look at this face. Wait, what is this? What is this face? What you know? You know, like uh, you ever seen somebody do like a uh, what do you call that? They do like scene work and stuff. And like what, what? 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 What do you think your face is doing right now? What? What kind of expression are you making? <laughs> what are you? What are you trying to convey with your facial expression? And I don't think he even is looking at himself. He's looking like through himself. He's just like literally mimicking the motions that he's seen of somebody looking into a mirror. Like a literal bug person. Q, I need the sound. I need card posting on my soundboard so I can just uh, soy new male bug man. <laughs> like, I know that people say that about fucking lefties, but this is the guy. Like, this is it, like when I think of a bug person, like Matt Walsh looks like he's covering up mouth parts. You know what I mean? Like, he, he, everything about his head is weird as fuck shaped. He's got, like, a bean-shaped fucking head with a goofy fucking mustache. Like, his beard comes out with a physical presence from his face. It's not attached to his face. He's drawn like a CalArts fucking uncle. You know what I mean? Like, like people are like, oh, I don't like the CalArts style. I complain about the CalArts style. And then you, like, watch Matt Walsh. He looks... Like simple, like simplified, like somebody was trying to be like, all right, well, we don't want to be too noticeable. The humans might pick up on the fact that you're a fucking alien, but then you see him actually like out from behind it when he's behind his desk with perfect lighting and like the ideal angle to pick up, hide as much of as his fucking head as possible. It's okay. 
But when you start seeing him like raw in the wild, like Matt Walsh uncensored, but like literally, like you could start seeing the rest of his body and how he moves it. You're like, what in the fuck is wrong with this creature? What is this fucking thing that you've, you fu- you're banding about in front of us like some sort of human being? What in the fuck is this? this? What? Like literally moving around like a fucking praying mantis. Like, actual literal bug-eyed, crab-eyed, fucking beady-eyed freak person. Just... You think you ever, like, you, you leave him around a human child that's got, like, red blood in its veins? He starts... <laughs> he can't fucking, like, you see stuff flexing on the side of his head as his fucking mouth parts try to fucking burst free of the stolen flesh he clads his exoskeleton in as he dives into another child's brain to devour it. Like, he's a fucking legitimately weird fucking guy. Weird as fuck. Like literally one of the top ten weirdo fucks on the on, on the fucking Republican side of things. It's so fucking unsettling how he is. Everything about him's fake. I know he doesn't like flannel. He's always in flannel. What no one wears this much flannel. Does he ever film like out of winter? This dude's always in a fucking flannel shirt for some fucking reason. I think it's because he's got no... He's an ex, he's got an exoskeleton. He's all fucking squishy meat with a fucking hard surface and then, like, human skin pulled tight over it. Like, a, like, like, like so much fucking... So much, uh, uh, uh Play-Doh. And they gotta cover him up in something that gives him some physicality. He's gotta have a thick-ass flannel on. Everyone's like, we're getting worried about you. And like, the, the thing that's most upsetting is it's fucking 65 degrees out. Why are you in flannel with an undershirt? <laughs> Where the fuck? Why are you cosplaying as a fucking lumberjack, you weirdo? You've never picked up anything in your life. He has the fucking... This dude has a forearm that's built like a, like a fucking... My thumb. I think my thumb has more fucking grip strength than his entire forearm does. Like, this is a guy that gets beat by most... Uh, non-assisted doors walking into buildings. You ever see somebody open a building in like downtown Chicago or some shit? The wind's blowing. It almost fucking takes him off. It would fling him like down the street. Go, oh! Oh! <laughs> he is like with this weird like I'm, I'm imitating a human voice. I'm t- uh, what are you saying that I'm a bug person? Bug person. Literal fucking bug. He's freaking me the fuck out. He should never be out from behind his desk. It's fucking weird to see him walking around and shit. It's ungainly. It's un- unseemly how his fucking body moves. He's so fucking weird. Why is he lumberjack maxing while he's built like a fucking bunch of goddamn matchsticks held together with chewing gum? What in the fuck? Who thought this was a good idea? I can't believe he's got... He's just been fucking astroturfed to to obscene fucking levels. And he has to lead with his bigotry because if you were just like, hey, do you see this guy? Do you think this is a fucking example of red-blooded American maildom? And then they go, no. who? This guy looks like he fucking pay pigs some chick named Jennifer who like comes over to his house and steps on his balls twice a week. Like... That's the that's the height of his fucking like existence in this fucking world. He's a weird fucking guy. It bugs the shit out of me, literally, literally. And then seeing him try to like pretend to be another person while pretending to be himself is extra fucking uncanny. It's so unsettling. It is like Black Mirror shit. What in the fuck? What? Why do they put him on camera? Who enjoys this? Who the fuck? I want to see the fucking audience of clittering, clacking, insectoid fucking freaks that are in the theater. (laughs) Watching him. They're all sitting there. Fucking like lights. Boo, 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 on their face. And then, like, they all have, like, a pheromone that tells them when to fucking laugh at the same time. They'll, oh, 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 o
<laughs> like the Catholic priest joke from South Park back in the day. Um, oh, I, I dropped a, uh, I dropped a, I was carrying plates as a human waiter does, and I, I dropped a uh, knife, and it made a noise that everybody looked at, and everyone in the crowd. <laughs> <laughs> A fucking usher walks in with a light. Uh, I don't know if you guys don't know this, but this theater is closed. They all Arr! and jump on him, start ripping him to pieces. Fucking blood and usher uniform flying into the fucking air. <laughs> Everything about this guy and his audience freaks me the fuck out. Like, they shouldn't exist. Uh, this isn't even, like, a political thing. He's too fucking weird. I, that is the stun lock. The Matt Walsh's fucking creepy as shit stun lock. So fucking unsettling. Such a weird, weird fucking guy. So creepy. I just don't understand it. Like, if you're a Matt Walsh fan, can you tell me what you appreciate about him? If there's a Matt Walsh fan out there, are you real even? Or does he just literally exist for like rage bait clips on Twitter? Like, are, are there Matt Walsh fans out there? They're like... Yeah, yo, yeah, brother. I love the way that you fucking dress in flannel in the middle of summer. I love the way you dress in flannel in the middle of summer and say, uh, and, and, and skirt the line with racism. That shit gets me. I, I, like, you could fucking be watching. You could be watching anybody. You could just, like, like literally just fucking pay Nick Fuentes. Nick, if you just give Nick Fuentes money, he'll just say a fucking slur for you. Like, you, it's like a dollar. You can just put a dollar into the Nick Fuentes live stream, wherever the fuck that is. Beep, 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 boop. And you <laughs> fucking just start popping off. He'll, he'll say all the slurs. If you just want to hear somebody say a slur, ah, fucking Mexicans are lazy. You can just pay for that. They'll just do it for you. Like, are you trying to get blue balls by a literal fucking grasshopper in human skin? Like, what, what in the fuck is the point of watching this shit? I would fucking blow my brains out before I went and sat down through it. I couldn't do it. I don't, I don't, I legitimately don't think I could. I was skipping through it because it was so fucking cringe. I could not watch what was on the screen. Like legitimately anybody that has ever typed out Matt Walsh's base, you're beyond irony pilled. You're like into, you're into dark territory, man. Like your fucking brain needs to be dissected for science. What in the fuck is wrong with you? What in the absolute fuck is actually fucking wrong with you? God damn. I can't fucking take it. Segment. I, I, I wanted to just cover that for a second, but he's so fucking weird. Hope you enjoyed your time on the web.